Oh, wow, look at this guy. Hello there. Who's that? That's our new bird. What? 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 to meet and hang out with one today. Oh my god. Do you have names for them? Well, I don't know. They were like thing one and thing two. <laughs> <laughs> And I don't know which one's the girl and the boy. I think, you see, if it was gonna go by Nelly and Monty, then this would be the boy and that would be the girl. Who are you? <laughs> I always do that, I'm like, who are you? Hello, my fellow snippers, flighters, and hatchlings. My name is Marlene McCohen. Welcome to my channel. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button because we're gonna have something very special happen today. As you guys know from my previous video, Finchie died of natural causes. If you wanna know about that, everything I do know about it is in another video, so go to that link. It's been a while and we gave time to Fiona to grieve. So it's time for Fiona to have a new friend. We can't leave a finch alone. Finches really need to be with friends. So I got a finch and it's coming today and it's a very special finch. So I can't wait for you guys to meet the finch. You wanna see what I got? Are you ready? Maybe Maybe I should get your reaction. Oh God, I'm not even camera ready. I was eating Doritos. What? Oh no. Oh my God. Oh my God. Hello. Hello. By the way. <laughs> so this is Fiona's new boyfriend. Oh. <laughs> oh, I love it. Oh. Isn't he handsome? So handsome. Yeah. He's white. Casper. Hey, Casper. That's why he's white. How you doing? Hi. Hi, Tina. Nice to see you. I lost the bird. Oh, <laughs> she caught it. Here. What's going on over here? We got a, a whole group of people. Oh my God. Hold on. That's your son? <laughs> he was so small before. No, that was a <laughs> small one. <laughs> I am five. <laughs> <laughs> George. Huh. As because What's up? Wow, look at this guy. Hello there. Who's that? That's our new bird. What? 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 Really? Why, why is he our new bird? Hey, buddy. Are you okay with that? I'm okay with any bird. No, he's not our new bird. I'm just kidding. Yeah. He's so cute. Isn't he the cutest? He's got the best sniff. But I do have a new bird for us. Another one? Mm -hmm. What, a, a finch? How did you know? Kind of cold. Is that what we have? <laughs> he's looking around like a Oh, wow. This guy's beautiful. Yeah. He kind of looks like he's a good mate for her. Yeah, I wanted her to have the best. He, is, he seems a little big for her, no? He's tiny compared to that. I mean, but they might like that, you know, the macho guy. I know a lot of girls go for <laughs> little baby. guys, but some some girls go for guys like Tina's son. How <laughs> <laughs> did you get such a tall? So what's this guy's name? We didn't name it. We actually have a lot of birds to name today. I don't today. know, he looks like a Don to me. A Don? don? Like Don Corleone. <laughs> this is Fiona Maybe Don. <laughs> Why don't you name him Shrek? Maybe Shrek and Fiona. Oh my gosh. Because he's so beautiful. Shrek's whole thing was 
Ugly. Hey, Don. Is he really? Is there Don Corleone? I think it's the wrong name. No, it's Don Corleone. It is? Isn't it? Don Corleone. Isn't that a movie, though? Hold what? on a second. You're confusing me now. Is that a real person? Hold on. Did, Why don't you just name him Al, like Al Capone? The Godfather is Don Corleone. <laughs> Wait, who plays that? It's Marlon Brando. Marlon Brando. Marlon Brando. Marlon Brando? Oh shoot, yeah, and Marlon Brando. Yeah, where he goes, I have, I'm gonna make you an offer you can't refuse. Don. Don Vito Corleone. So he's Don Vito? Oh my god, you could be Don Vito. What do you guys think? I'm, I'm like, I, That's kind of cute, because like, we have Brando and we would have Don Vito. Am I gonna go like Don Vito? You know what? It's your, it's your bird. George, did you notice Don and Vito? Oh really, their names are Don? No. What name do you have? <laughs> Probably not a good one right now. What mom name? No, right now I'm thinking Humpty Dumpty. Tweedledee and Tweedledum. Mom. Who are the honeymooners? Alice and. Who's the other one? What about Lucy and Desi? <gasps> That's so cute. You like that? I love What about Ricky and Lucy? Uh, Lucy and Ricky? Lucy and Desi. <laughs> She's not That's listening. great. I like it. Lucy and Desi. This one doesn't have a name. George, did you see this? Why do we have so many little names? George, look at this one. A baby ring neck. Did you get on your tail? What kind of personality do you want the bird to have? Well, my other one is pretty mischievous, Cloud. Oh, you have one named Cloud? Mm -hmm. Oh, do you want it to match something like that? Rain. Rain? Rain? <gasps> I love it. I like that. Rain. Rain! Oh, look at that ring! Smell that one. It'd be nice. Those are glucy. Yeah, and then you might like this. That's a blue one. This is a baby blue. A baby ring neck. They don't know how to step up yet, so you have to hold them like... He's doing real good. He's doing real good. Wow, that's a big one, huh? Hi, baby. You want to hold it? Oh, yeah, I'm found it. Oh, it's very soft. Right? Nice feathers. Also fat. That's it. He's a Can you go to come on? Why do you want to go to bed? Because Danny's upstairs. Let's see you walk on the floor. Do your funny Makala walk. Difference between having a hyacinth macaw and a harlequin macaw. Okay. Oh my gosh, they're worlds apart. Hyacinths are very, they're called the gentle giants. And so, the, and they are that. They're so sweet. They're, she's so sweet. She, she's nice to everybody. The harlequin, he's a spaz. He's everywhere. He's flying, he's running, he's harassing the other birds. He's on top of my head. He's two, he's only two, but he's so energetic. He's all over the place. He's just as clingy, but if um, Bella's there, he won't come around. Is he nice to Bella? He kind of gives her her space. He's kind of scared of her. And then my Conyers will dive and dive bomb him. He's kind of a big chicken. He's like all over the place. I love this bird. Oh my God, baby. Thank you. So with baby birds, they don't really have much balance yet, so you can't really expect them to step up on two fingers, so you always have to hold them safely. How old is this bird? Six weeks. Whoop. So you're hand feeding him? Yeah. I spoon feed him. Look at this face, Rain. Oh my God. It's crazy how amazing birds are. For me, it's it's my escape from work. If you have a hard day, they're not gonna give you a second to think about what went on at work. They're like, pay attention to me. I'm they right actually here. help me with my obsessive compulsive disorder because I don't have to. You have that too. <laughs> yeah, if I have free time, like I went to Washington one time and the whole city shuts down at like 6 p.m. and then you hear the crickets and then suddenly I'm in my head and I think like, 
because I itched on my right foot, I'm gonna die or someone's gonna die or something and I like <laughs> lose my mind and I get, I need to be doing something all the time. That's me too. The joke is I'm like a shark. If I stop moving, I'll die. Yeah. Do you wanna see how you walk or anything? Look at those leggies, look at those leggies. Aww. It's getting better. <laughs> this was amazing. Oh my don't be scared to come back. You don't even have to come back with birds. Okay. Well, you can come I back probably and, will. Yeah, come please back with actually birds. only come back with your <laughs> Have a safe drive with all my nieces and nephews. Okay. <laughs> There's lots of reasons why you may have a bird suddenly and you may not be ready for a bird. So some things you want to keep on hand. <laughs>